episode of Frangela's Idiot of the Week is brought to you by Gamefly. Go to Gamefly.com slash haha for your free 15-day trial. Hi, I'm Angela V. Shelton, and this is my very best friend. Hi, I'm Frances Callier, and we are Frangela. And welcome to Frangela's Idiot of the Week. Week, 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 week. This is where we take the time to give the stupid their time to shine. Yes, they're day in the sun because they are dumb. And on t- this Monday, the stack is it smells like stupid. Ooh. It's a delicious, stupid, stupid Monday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's get started, shall we? We shall. I think we should. Yeah. <laughs> Frisky couple on water slide caught having sex on close caption TV. Now. Um, that's, see, that's, that's the couple. Yeah. That's a children's water slide. This is a family fun water park. Thank you. First of all, can we start with, I have a problem with adults being in the water park to begin with. Yeah. It's for the children. It's for the children. Okay. You have your freaky times in your backyard, grotto. <laughs> yes. You know, right, above right, right. ground, or below ground, I don't care. But you, you know, that's for children. The water park is for children. Second of all, the water park is already filthy and disgust. I know. And now you're putting your, your, your num nums in it? No, 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 no. You know, if you want to get down in some water times, what you need to do is get yourself a hose. That's right. Okay. What's the driveway for? That, thank you. What's, it, what's the gutter for? Uh, Here's my other problem. Hmm. Those water slides are not very long. No. They're not 15 minutes long even. <laughs> so I'm thinking this is not a very good lay to begin with. Yes. Because if it's over in the length of time it takes to get down a water slide. Yes. Have I even gotten my panties or my, my bathing suits pushed to the side <laughs> in time? And what, this is what I also want to know. What you doing about the backup of the people behind you? Because you know there's, there's some children waiting to get out that hole. <laughs> Well, you've got to get done. They can't interrupt the coitus or there will be no children. You see, they're trying to teach children in the moment. Yes. The moment. People don't do this. No. Don't do this. No, this no, This makes no. you stupid and nasty. Yes. And I, well, not in front of the children. It's bad. People getting colds all over the place, flu. I, every place I go, they're trying to give me a flu shot now. And I got to deal with you fucking in my <laughs> the public water park pool. I didn't want to have a shot for that. Didn't have a shot for that. That's the thing, Angela. I didn't want to go in the first place. That's, okay? No, you didn't. You did okay, not it's hot. Go in the first place. It's sweaty. It's. No. It, I don't feel good. I did no. not want to buy a swimsuit. No, well, because that's hell. And okay. I got, and no. I, got to, I got to deal with you fucking on the water slide. Oh hell no. I, first of all, I'm not fucking. I'm with kids. I don't even have kids, but I'm stuck with all my friends who have kids. Yes. And I'm Aunt Angela coming to the water park. There I am. Yes. And you? Mm. No. No. There's not even booze there. What no. are you doing? Come on. What, and what turned you on exactly? The dirty plastic? Yeah. You, you know what? Because I can't see, see somebody at home be like, yeah, water slide. You know what would be really cool? What? If we went to Legoland and hit it. Hey! Yeah, Legoland! People back seats. <laughs> yeah, what happened? Bushes, alleys. What happened to the good old American ways of having sex in public? Restrooms. Restroom. Next up. Next up for today, Monday's Idiot of the Week nominee. <laughs> Okay, you, you want me to say? Um, um, okay. Um, I... Teen sets off deer urine bombs in store. Okay. This is in Alabama. Alabama. Okay. These teens were arrested for allegedly setting off deer urine bombs at a Walmart store, causing over eleven thousand dollars worth of damage. Now, this is what I want to know, Angela. Yes, Francis. How you get deer pee? Well, this is the problem I have, and you're going to have to, we're going to need to hear from you yes. at Frangela Duo at Twitter or at Facebook at Frangela Duo. Mm-hmm. Please please write to us and let us know, are, are, are you, dear urine bombs something that you can easily acquire? Yes. Because we're from, I'm from Detroit. I'm from, from Chicago. Chicago. We don't encounter deer. To me, this, I have a problem here, because unless this is a prepackaged device, the gathering of the urine is, is, is problematic for This me. is what I number need to one. know. Number one. Number two, why would you have a dear urine bomb? No, I believe that there's some information we don't have. Okay, right, 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 right. Something about hunting. Or something. Or something. Maybe if you put deer urine on things, it attracts. But what eats deers besides people? Bears. Do you really want a bear hunt? That seems stupid. I don't know. Why would you do that? I don't know. I don't know. I don't understand. And why do kids have access to anything with the word bomb in it? Yeah. And look at this child. Your child is, this is a stupid kid. Yeah. See, this yeah. is this is this is one of my arguments. What, play at home. What the hell is wrong with you? Yeah, Get on yeah. the internet and look at some porn like a normal American child. Yeah, what yeah, are you yeah. doing? Yeah. Well, I mean, you know whatever happened to people playing Uno? Andrew? Don't you have a game box, a speed box, or some <laughs> kind of crap? PlayStation, Xbox, uh, speak and spell. I don't <laughs> care. Some <laughs> kind of Frogger. What the hell, you children into deer urine? Nasty. Playing with urine is nasty. And you're nasty. stupid. And, you, and it makes you stupid. Eleven thousand dollars in damage. Yeah. It makes you wonder why the woods are okay. <laughs> 
I, I want to know Deer when it is really damaging. <laughs> when did you get dead pissed? Uh, you know what? You have to write to us again, Frangela Duo at Twitter or Frangela uh, at Facebook, Frangela Duo, because I don't know. We need to know. We need to know. Next up, our third nominee for today, Monday, for Idiot of the Week, <laughs> Rami Newkirk. Yeah. 45. Yeah. Let's all say it. It's a hard 45 years. It's a hard 45. Every one of those had to have been in a gulag. That's <laughs> yes. I think he was in prison as a fetus. Yes. That is hard time. Rammy was accused of attacking Rammy. his Lisa own. Lisa Rammy. Hello. <laughs> accused of attacking his own mother with what? A bottle of eggnog. Now don't let don't don't think that Rami does not get into the Christmas spirit yeah, it's, here. Okay, first of all, let's just say it was it is seasonal. It is seasonal. Had it been a flag, I'd be like, that's not the Fourth of July, Rami. What up? But don't hit your mama with some eggnog. Also, but also, it gets worse. It gets worse. You go. There are problems, and his Rami and his mother have problems. First of all, Rami's forty-five and lives at home. Right. You could have guessed that from the photo, I'm sure. Yes. Second of all, Rami um, has threatened to kill his mother mm -hmm. if she reported him to the authorities right. for the uh, eggnog attack. And then he um, he hit her with a stun gun. Yeah. Now, uh, does that mean he stunned her or that he hit her with a gun? <laughs> I think he stunned her. Because it, it doesn't say he stunned her. I, I, I think he went, zap! Who you gonna tell about the eggnog? Zap! See, again, we say this all the time, Frangela. What do we say? When when you know your child is crazy. Yes. Okay, that Randy didn't get crazy on his 44th birthday. Mm -mm. He's been crazy since he toddled out, out of your, your area. Yes. That was a crazy fetus. Mm -hmm. It's been a crazy newborn. And, and a, a crazy teenager, toddler, a teenager. teenager. Your yard's full of dead, tortured animals. Turn him in! <laughs> Please. It's going to be a hard one this week, Francis. And it's going to be really, know. really hard. I know, already, it's only Monday. Yes, and we're going to need you to weigh in, okay? You can go come and visit us and let us know who you think the idiot of the week is by going to Facebook and going to French Le Duo, going to Twitter and going to French Le Duo. Yeah, you can find us there. That's right. You can see the past episodes of Idiot of the Week at Sideshow TV. Or yes. it's a Sideshow Network. Yes. Not TV. Anytime. Anytime. And on iTunes, obviously. That's right. And uh, check in for tomorrow's idiot, Tuesday, because if it's already this good on Monday. Yeah. Friday, I think we're going to have a really hard decision to make. Yeah. I'm Francis Callier. And I'm Angela V. Shelton. We're Frangela. And thank you for watching Frangela's Idiot of the Week. Week, 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 week. Don't forget to go to Gamefly.com slash haha and get your 15-day trial from Gamefly. They have over 7,000 titles to choose from for all game systems and handhelds. No late fees, free shipping, cancel anytime. That's Gamefly.com slash haha to get your free 15-day trial. Gamefly, games delivered.